Today we are testing out the new K2 Mindbender 90C skis. This is a ski that K2 claims is snappy, quick, light, and accessible for intermediate to advanced skiers. First off, let's get some things clear. We are not sponsored by any brand. We are not getting paid to review any of these products. These are purely the opinions of the curated ski expert community and not the opinions of the brand. Oh, hello, I didn't see you there. Just kidding, it's me again. Here I am on the K2 Mindbender 90C ski. This is the narrower width ski of the K2 Mindbender line. Overall, this ski performs really, really well for what it is intended to be, which is uh, an intermediate mid-level ski. This is something that is very, very accessible to somebody who is coming out of the rental line, coming out of lessons. Like if you're a beginner skier and you have one or two seasons and you're really psyched on skiing and you want something that's gonna allow you to progress all the way up to the advanced level, this could be the ski for you. If you're a very fast, aggressive racer type skier, there's probably another better option for you. Honestly, it's a, it's a pretty dang fun front side ski. This ski does really well at speed, actually. I wouldn't say this is the type of ski that you wanna be going straight down, uh, straight down the run on, but if you're going edge to edge down a, a reasonably steep run, it'll be pretty fun. It's gonna feel nice and responsive and just generally be a good one to take you down the mountain. This is definitely a directional ski. You can see there's no twin tip on the end. Um, on top of that, there's hardly any um, early splay, early rise rocker in the tip. It likes a little bit more of a friendlier terrain. I think that if you're more interested in freestyle skiing, this is not gonna be the ski for you. Uh, if you're really a bonsai skier and you like going 50 miles an hour, this is not gonna be the ski for you. All in all, this ski is great for the athletic beginner who really wants to go to the next level and wants something that they can progress on and ski all over the mountain on in just about any condition. Maybe someone that's starting to take their family out skiing and wants a ski that will be easy to ski around at slow speeds but can still like dip off for a few runs and do some fast runs by themselves. Uh, I think those, that type of person will be great for this ski. So there are obviously a lot more skis on the market and these are a few of our favorites, but to find out which ski might be the best one for you, reach out to one of our curated experts and we'll get you taken care of. 